All right. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Jaden Building back again with another video. All right. So we got Peter Woods. Now, Peter Woods is um, one of the top 25 players in the country in the class of 2023. He's uh, number three defensive lineman in the country. He's a five star, and he recently been offered a scholarship from JSU, right? So he, you know, mind you, he's crystal ball to go to Alabama, and he just said something about I think probably yesterday that he said that he was waiting on Jackson State's offer. Because now he saw what, what Travis Hunter did, and now he's thinking about doing the exact same thing, right? So he has currently put Jackson State at the top of the list in terms of his offers. So wouldn't it be insane, like wouldn't it be absolutely crazy for Jackson State to go and steal a recruit right under Nick Saban's nose, especially after the BS that Nick Saban said, right? Like that, would, like, that would be absolutely insane. So, we are about to watch his highlights. And we're about to see how much of a beast he is. Yo, what, yo, it would be an absolute insane thing that he would take a recruit. He would take a recruit from Alabama. Like, it would be insane. Like, mind you, like, he took Travis Hunter from Florida State. Mm, parked the ball out. He would take, he would take, he took. He already took Travis Hunter from Florida State. Now he gonna take another. He could possibly take another five-star recruit from another Power Five program. Like how sick would that be? Like how, yo, how just how sick would that? That would be absolutely insane. Like, mm. yeah, he he aggressive. I right. okay. What we doing with it then? Hmm. Hey. Wow, that's crazy. And he's fast, too. He got some speed to him. I'm not going to front. He got some speed to him. Yeah, he, he definitely got some speed to him. I like it. Yeah, he he definitely got some speed to him. Mm, pulls his arm. He's really good with his hands. He works real good with his hands. He definitely have, have a fast get up off the ball. Bro, look how fast he is. Look how fast he is. Yeah, he... Mm, he's pretty fast. Psst, look how he works his hands. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he yeah he had great hand work. Yo, look. Bro, his reaction time is nuts. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. That would be insane. Mm, come here. No, sir. He definitely know how to work, though. He he definitely got, from the looks of things, he got a good motor on him. Like, he, he can definitely go for a minute. Off the edge. The patience. But he goes from being patient to, like, you see how quick his reaction time is from him set, you know, him trying to set the edge. And just the strength, too. You can see the strength. Plays inside, yeah. Pushes him, yeah. Oh, he a, he's a problem. Mm, okay. Oh no. He definitely know how to work, but he <laughs> he's a problem. Mhm. Mm oh, look at this dude. He damn near took his own teammate out. Yo, boy, got some strength to him, boy. Mm-hmm. Come on. Uh-uh. He likes that. He, he, he beats the double team and gets the sack. He beats the double team from the inside. He blow... Bruh, he... That's crazy. He blows up the pulling guard and, and and gets to the quarterback. It's insane. Boy, that boy know how to work his hands. That boy really know how to work his hands. You see the hand work? Yeah, you see, see how good you know. See how good his hand work? Look at that. Hmm. 
Yeah, he, bro. Yeah, this would be, this would be insane. Like, what a hell of, what, what a hell of a get back it would be. This would be the ultimate payback. Like, <laughs> this would be the ultimate ha. I told you so. Like, we're really trying to change the culture, and you over here worried about us paying a million dollars for a player, as if we have a million dollars in the budget. Like, Jackson State did. They, they barely had twenty thousand for travel expenses on recruiting. Like, check this out. So. Like I said, like, it's bad enough that Jackson State barely had over 20000 for for travel expenses with, with their recruiting process. But the fact that they're being accused of having paying a million dollars to one player, like, like they don't see that that Coach Prime is really, really trying to change change the the culture of HBCU football as a whole. So, yeah. Like coach, like Nick Saban really, like Coach Saban really doesn't know the type of, uh, the type of pigeon, or like the type of stress that he's about to put himself through for the next few years, because the playing field has definitely been leveled. So yeah, it, it's about to be, it, it's about to be a. Hey, I'll tell you this, give it. Two to three years that well, I give it five years that Alabama would be the powerhouse that it used to be. Cause HBCU football. <laughs> oh man, Nick Saban, dog, and lost his damn mind.